Hey, it's Tim with Power Up Social Media. I want to introduce you to a really cool tool. It's called Manage Flitter, and you can easily find it at manageflitter.com, as you can see in the top bar there. I use Manage Flitter every single week, and I use it as part of the Twitter shuffle. Now, the Twitter shuffle is basically following a bunch of people you think are going to be interested in your message, then maybe three, four, or five days later, unfollowing those people who don't follow you back. That's because Twitter limits how many people you can follow. If you do the Twitter shuffle, you can quickly grow your Twitter following. I use Manage Flitter to quickly unfollow people. This is the first screen you're going to see. You want to click Start, and of course, you want to connect to Twitter. Enter whatever username and password it is for the account that you want to get into. And then once it all loads up, this is the screen that you're going to see. On the left side of the screen, there's a tab for not following back. There's one for no profile image, and that usually means somebody's not very active on Twitter if they don't have a profile image, and there's also one for people who are inactive. Now, Manage Flitter considers anybody who hasn't posted over the last 30 days to be inactive. I'm going to go to the people who are not following me back. As you can see, there are 48 people who are not following me back right now. You can go to one of these or each of these boxes and click on them if you want to, but that's really painstaking. There's an easy way to take care of this, and that's by going right here to expand. This box opens up, and there's profile pictures for all the people who are not following me back. This is real easy. Just click and drag over these profiles, and it's going to highlight them in pink. Now, there's no problem following people who are verified who don't follow you back or people who are popular who don't follow you back. That's because it's easy for people to find you on those accounts and, and possibly follow you. So I'm going to deselect here on the right side, deselect verified accounts, and I'm also going to deselect popular accounts. And then it's really easy. Just go up to the unfollow 33 selected or whatever number it's going to be for you. Click that. And just like that, in a snap of the fingers, I'm unfollowing 33 people. You can do the same thing for people who are inactive if you want to. But just for the sake of making this video pretty short, I'm not going to do that right now. ManageFlitter.com, again, a very simple way to unfollow people. Since I just unfollowed 33, that means I can now follow 33 or even more people than that and add to my Twitter following. If you want to learn more about the Twitter shuffle, we have a ton of information in our pure training product. You can find that at PowerUpSocialMedia.com. Otherwise, hopefully you find Manage Flitter very easy to use and also very useful in your quest to quickly grow your Twitter following. Until next time, it's Tim with Power Up Social Media.